time for the Couch Cannon Hand of the Night. It's where we only reveal the loose cannons cards, and you at home try to play the hand from their perspective. Let's light this candle. Massimiliano Martinez with pocket eights. Should be a pretty easy raise with a pair. Going to raise it to 1,300. Phil folds. My read is that Phil had a bad hand. Boom, <laughs> when's lunch? <laughs> Tario Minieri makes the call. Elkie's yeah, out. Hard. And Lock is out. Perkins folds. So only one hand to figure here, Joe. Dario's in position, so his range doesn't have to be super strong. Plus, he's got a little uppity lately. A six queen rainbow. Not a very good flop for two eights, but I think Max has got to take a stab with a C bet in position anyway. And he does bet 1,700. And Minieri calls. Pretty quick call, and it's a dry board, so he's probably not on a draw. Turn, deuce of diamonds. Firing another barrel is one way to go, but I'm actually fine with just giving up at this point. This loose cannon does not give up. Looks like he's gonna try to keep the betting lead here. And bets 4,600. I put Dario on pocket aces, Joe, because I always put everyone on pocket aces. Well, when you're beat, you're beat. And Dario calls. Guessing he will put in a raise at some point if he has pocket aces, Scott. Ten of clubs on the river. My argument here is the same as the turn, only now the board is even worse for two eights. And Max looks like he's shutting down. He checks. I mean, Yari checks behind. Did he win? Look at eight. Max shows him the eights. I don't like his chances. We'll see what Dario has. A jack and an ace. He's going to have the winner. I'm a solid player. Ace, jack call. Yep. Check behind. Yep. Why do you always get to think of bluff all the times? Last.